You were right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Welcome back, everyone. How are you doing? Yeah. We're so excited to have you back it's in the cat. corner. I'm Crackwise Magazine editor in chief, Kathy yeah. Vogel. Flum Bastard Ollie, Mookie, Oscar, Mo, Barry, Joe Bot. And she's out of her trailer now. Kathy Vogel is here. Yes, she's yeah. looking good. But most importantly, it's the corner of his we sit in. Comedian Mike Conley. The cornerstone of the corner. Oh, yeah. yeah. Hi, kids. He's yeah. the rock of the corner. Oh, okay. Oh, or the cornerstone. Whatever. Yeah. So. Somebody fix that cat. I don't know. Somebody needs to kick it. It's in heat. <laughs> so let's talk about dating. Ugh. People have been worried about getting catfished. You've yeah. heard stories left and right about getting catfished and so glad I'm not out dating out there. So singles, now you need to worry about kitten fishing. Yeah. So what is kitten fishing? Yeah. I know, we're all asking that. It's the less offensive act that involves misrepresenting yourself on a dating profile. So basically, it's a kitten, not the full-grown cat. Oh. It's not the full-on lie. It's basically. See, I was I was nervous that it was underage. Cats. No, 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 oh, no, 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 no. It's not going for underage cats. But you're misrepresenting little facts about yourself. For example, you can say, um, "Yeah, I'm college educated," but you don't mention that you dropped out halfway through college. So technically, you are college educated, but you're not a graduate. Or you're posting photos when you were 15 pounds lighter. I mean, mm -hmm. yeah, that was you, not you currently. Right. It's little things like that that you're putting out there oh, that's no. not helping. What are we doing? Thank you. Oh, no, he's batting it around like a kitten. And I don't have my water bottle to squirt him in the face. <laughs> I'd throw my phone, but I like my phone. <sighs> oh, so that's kitten fishing. So you have to watch out for that. It's happening a lot. I think people do this, not in just dating, but in their lives in general. You know, people just kind of throw things out there and you're like, wait a minute. Yeah. So that's kitten fishing. So watch out for it, single folks. Do your investigative skills. You know how to do that. And if you're, and if you're still unsure yeah. what she means, mm -hmm. look at your resume. Yeah. Because you buffed that up pretty good. Yes, you, you do. know you did. <laughs> <laughs> so here are some things that you shouldn't actually do to a kitten if you have one. Yeah. Yes. And boy, this was something I couldn't research at the library. <laughs> Speaking from experience. Yes. Don't let them get in the bathtub with you. Yeah. yeah. Because in general, well, they like to come over and, and like some of them try to drink the water, which is gross. Ew. But the one, if they get, if they get, Anywhere too close, of course, you're naked in the bathtub. Yeah. And they fall in. Right. Yeah. They don't like to get wet. Yeah. So the claws come out. <laughs> no. And if the claws no. come out, then there's going to be blood drawn <laughs> and not in a medical way. <laughs> so it's not good. So no tubby time with Tabby is all I'm saying with that one. Yeah, that's probably. And sage. along the lines of kitten fishing. Yes. Do not give your little kitten some ferocious name like killer or slasher or something like that because <laughs> i mean you're amongst your friends and you're like call out hey, come here killer and they're expecting some pity to come around right. the corner or yeah. some rottweiler and here comes this little ball of fur that you just can't pick up and hug to death and now you look like an idiot <laughs> and finally and ladies this is a little uncomfortable for me <clears throat> uh-huh in the effort to stay on the internet. Okay. Be very careful when you talk about your kitten around your significant other. Yeah. Okay. Information and communication is what this entire magazine is about. Okay, here at Crackwise. So if your family kitten is stuck under the bed. Oh no. Do not yell out so your person can hear. Help, I, I need help with my kitty. <laughs> Because they're going to come around the corner naked, and it's, the cat is never coming out from underneath the bed. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, don't yell out that your pussy's stuck. Wow, yeah, don't. don't. Because you mean your cat. Right. Because that's what it is. Hello, I Hello. don't even know what you're thinking. Hello. Don't be filthy, people. No, please. It's fun formation, not porn formation. 
at Crackwise. Could be, but it's not. You know, we haven't started OnlyFans yet. <laughs> The drink recipe of the week is at the bottom of the page when don't you're on the website. Don't give any to your cat. Yeah, don't. Yeah. And we're Conley won't be kitten fishing because he's right. not a liar. No. no, no, no. You'll get nothing but the truth. This, this is, is what you get, ladies. This is it. If yes. You, if you don't like it, there's more booze for me. <laughs> I don't care anymore. I just don't care. Sign up for our newsletter while you're at CrackWiseMag.com. It's free. It's non-spammy. You could win a $25 Visa gift card, too, for oh, signing up for that. the newsletter. You can go shopping. And don't forget to like us on socials yes yeah i think that's about it right yeah i think so thanks everybody next time for that damn cat today's episode of comedy's core is brought to you by Now in Spanish. Meow, 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 really? I'm not even Spanish and I'm offended. <laughs> Ciao. Ciao.